Morning everybody. So it is 9 a.m. and I'm emptying the dishwasher. All very exciting. Sorry if you can hear lots of noise in the background. Leo's watching a film and just generally terrorizing the place. So I haven't done just a standard normal day in the life for a while and today is a pretty open day i thought it'd be a good day to do it obviously i've just got out of the shower that was fun leo normally he'll watch telly when i'm in the shower no not this morning he was literally just stood staring at me in the bathroom the entire time very off-putting but i am showered so that's something so today really uh the agenda is go to town to run a few errands, uh, do a food shop. So I'll go to Asda, because that's in town. I wanna do tea. What do you wanna do? Tea. Tree? Tea. Tea. What do you wanna do? You can't have cakey, darling. It's nine o'clock in the morning. Cakey. You can have a banana. Banana. You want a banana? Yeah. It's a bit old. I have to get some new bananas when we do the food shopping. There you go. It's not dirty. It's not dirty. Sometimes nanas are brown and sometimes they're white. It's not dirty. Taste it. It's yummy. See? Yeah, so food shop. Erin's in town. Need to buy more um, brown paper to wrap my presents. Um, there was something else as well, but it slipped my mind. Um, then we need to go to the pet shop to get dog food. Then it'll probably be time to come home and have a nap. Then the afternoon's pretty open. I want to take Trevor out for a walk. He hasn't been for a walk for a couple of days because the weather's just been dismal. So we'll see how the weather is later. So like not a special day, not an exciting day, but just a normal mum day. If you're new to my channel and you're wondering um, why I'm on my own, basically I, I'm on my own Monday to Friday pretty much every week. My other half, Leo's daddy, um, owns his own business, which is amazing. We're very, very proud of him. He works very, very hard. But it means that he is all over the country five days a week. So pretty much on a normal week, we can expect him to be gone, you know, as far as Scotland, as far as Spain. He's been everywhere. Um, we can expect him to be gone Monday to Friday and it's just me and Leo Monday to Friday and then we get daddy at the weekend that's pretty normal for us so that's why it's just us because today is Monday and Clint left at 5am this morning to go away for the week don't ask me where he is this week because I actually can't remember I'm just so bad at remembering he gets so cross with me about that. Also, quick life update um, that I'm going to talk about more on a video that I'm going to do later in the week. Um, but Leo has dropped his dummy. <laughs> dropped, uh, forcibly dropped his dummy um, a few days ago. So basically, Santa phoned, of course, and told him he was a big boy. Let's put dummy in the bin. So he happily went and put dummy in the bin. And I was like, and then that night was the night from hell uh just constantly crying pretty much all night it was relentless um it was awful he was like shoving his fingers in his mouth he just didn't know he didn't know how to sleep without it because he's had it since he was literally like two days old and you know he's coming up to three now so he doesn't know life without it it was really hard to watch but it was one night of hell and then last night he slept half six till seven solid didn't wake once, didn't cry once. As hard as cold turkey is, it got it over quick. But like I said, I'll talk more about it in a separate video, but I just thought I'd update you on that. Cause I am a bit nervous about nap time. Cause I don't know how nap time will go without D-U-M-M-Y. Um, so it's only nine o'clock. I don't plan on going to the shops for a little while. I just want to chill in pajamas for a bit longer and finish doing all the fun jobs that mums do in the morning. Right, developments. We are dressed. Where is he? Here he is. And we're about to head out to run our errands. I've also told him, if he's a good boy, um, that we'll go to soft play. Haven't I, Leo? We going to soft play? Yeah, so I'm gonna take him to soft play. There's one in town, so that'll be easily done. I just wanted, before I go to do the food shop, I wanted to write down 
on my meal planner because I always write on here first before I go to the supermarket, it just makes it easier. So we're gonna have sausage and sweet potato tonight. I've already got the sweet potatoes, so I just need sausages. Um, I think I've got veg as well. Yeah, I've got carrots, so I don't need anything for that really, just sausages. Tomorrow we'll have dinner with my mum and dad. Wait, quiet. Wednesday I'm having some old work friends over for a mince pie party, and I'm gonna cook a big spag bowl for the kids because they'll be, three kids eating, so I need stuff for that. Thursday I'll make me and Leo a little curry, curry night, because he loves that. Friday I'm going out with my friends for Christmas dinner, so I couldn't consult him out, because he'll be home on Friday. Saturday, I don't know, Sunday we're going to see Santa, so we'll probably eat out when we're seeing Santa, so I always take a picture of this on my phone before I go to the supermarket, and I just feel more organized. Also, thank God for beanies, because it's covering up a multitude of sins right now. I just need to get his coat on and his shoes, get my bags for life. Uh, and we're going to go. May you always find your way to higher ground. We are back home and we completed all our errands, which is good. We went to soft play, didn't we? And we got lucky at soft play because when I got there, my friend was there with her little girl who's like two weeks apart from Leo. So they were playing together, that was nice. Then we went to the supermarket, we went to Asda, did the food shop, got Trevor's dog food um, and a couple of other bits I needed to get. So. We're on top of it, aren't we, Leo? So I'm gonna go in now, unpack the shopping, make us some lunch. We we got some, hot, we're going in the house. We got some hot cross buns from Asda and I'm gonna make us some of those for lunch. Not very substantial, I know. But he's Mommy's literally- mine always. What, baby? He's been snacking all morning. He was snacking in the supermarket, snacking at soft play, so he'll be fine. Well, I thought I may as well show you what I got because some people find that interesting. I love seeing what people buy. I like being nosy, so why not? Disclaimer, this is not an inspirational food shop. <sighs> yeah, it ain't my best work, but I'll, st I'll still show you what I got. So, this we're excited about. We got this, didn't we, Leo? Oh, he's busy zipping up his wallet. Do you want some help? Anyway, we got these. These are gonna be a post-nap treat. I'm kind of hoping that it's gonna be like a nap blackmail because we get to make the cakes when he wakes up, but we'll see. Bread, I needed some conditioner. Cookies, because as to do the most incredible cookies. Corn pieces for our curry night. Curry sauce for curry night. Naan bread for curry night. Chopped tomatoes and a bolognese sauce for um, when the kids are over for tea on Wednesday. Mini rolls, because they were on offer and they're just bloody great, aren't they? That's for me tonight. This is Mummy's little corner. Mama. Because I'm addicted to chocolate. What? Yeah, we're gonna do that later after nap time. Uh, these are my ready meals that I take to work. I work two days a week in mommy. a primary school. So mommy. I take these to work. They're Mummy's, thank you. Mini cheddars. An emergency pasta sauce if I'm stuck for dinner any night this week. Mints for the kids on Wednesday. These we're gonna have tonight instead of sausages. These are so delicious, cod bites. These are sausages. They are honestly so, so yummy. So we're gonna have those with potatoes and veg. These are just a good little lunchtime snack. Some bananas, and Leo had one in the supermarket, didn't you? Yeah, okay. yeah we're gonna have those in a minute. Strawberries, petitfilo, watermelon, because that's his favorite. Rice for curry night, Cheerios, Cheerios, Pepsi Max for Mama, Ready Max for Mama, and dog food for Trevi. We did quite well, didn't we? Um, Should we have one of these now before no. you go to sleep? No. Do you want one of these? Yeah. Yeah, we'll have one now before before nap time, and after nap time we'll make us our, our snowman cakeies. Yeah. Mummies. Yeah, I'm gonna make you one now. Talking.
So he is awake. There he is. Um, that was very successful. He was asleep for about an hour and a half, an hour and 45, which is um, what I would expect if he had a dummy. So no change there. I am completely relieved because a part of me thought maybe he'll just stop naps altogether because he doesn't have his D-U-M-M-Y, but no. So that's a win for me. No. Yeah, you're such a good boy, aren't you? Me. You are such a good boy. Yeah. Yeah. You're mummy's angel. Aren't you, darling? You like the camera? Uh, I'm feeling like a bad mummy now because Fire. I feel like a bad mummy because we just went to make the snowman cakes and we can't make them, can we? Because we haven't got any eggs. <laughs> Silly mummy, didn't read the box and I didn't know that we would need eggs. I just thought it was one of those really easy ones where you just literally add water. Please. And now I feel awful because I promised we'd do it after nap time and I haven't got any eggs. So I told him that we'll do them tomorrow instead and mummy will get some eggs tomorrow and we'll make them tomorrow instead. Yeah, Leo? Yeah. Yeah, okay. And luckily he's just such a good boy and is very understanding. <laughs> what? Cheeky boy! What do you want? I'm not a cheeky boy! Oh, you are a cheeky boy. No, I'm not a cheeky boy. I'm Leo. Oh, okay. I just realised I'm not sure if you guys have had the pleasure of seeing Leo's Christmas tree. So we got him his own Christmas tree. Yeah. To have in the playroom, didn't we, darling? Yeah. And he picked all the decorations and he decorated it himself. So, <laughs> I mean, no awards going to anyone who guessed he decorated it himself. But he is very, very happy with it. We've got all sorts of things on here. <laughs> and we're off with a very reluctant bulldog who we have to drag out the door. Oi, come on, keep going. He's eight and a half, our Trevor, so he's a bit old and a bit slow. Oh, you're doing so well, darling, holding the lead. Are we going to go find some worms? Yeah. Yeah? yeah there's one there. There's one there? Yeah. Look in the grass. We always make a pit stop in the park. And we walk Trevi, don't we? Trevi waits patiently over by the gate. I mean, it's not your most incredible park you've ever seen, but Leo likes it, so that's all that matters. So we'll have five minutes in here, and then, and then we walk in a big circle all the way back to the Hi. house. Hi! Go down the slide. Oh, too hard. It's not too hard. Go, go, go. Oh, it's a bit slow this slide. That's it! <laughs> I think he always forgets that it's a bit of a rubbish slide. Was that good? <laughs> Have you got a wet bum? Oh, we're okay. A little hack for you when you're walking and your child is demanding to be carried. Give him a stick. He's asking me to carry him. For the last five minutes I gave him a stick. Happy as Larry. These kids don't need expensive things. Just sticks. We're sitting down to dinner. Is it nice? Yeah. We've got our fish nuggets, we've got our sweet potato, and what's this? Carrot. Carrot, good boy. So we're just gonna have a nice dinner together, um, and it's time to sign off so I can have dinner with my, with my boy. Thank you so much for watching my latest normal mum life vlog. I'm super here, my name is Okay, and I'll see you in my next one.